How's it going, YouTube world? Welcome to the first episode of Rod's Reviews. Uh, simply put, this channel is going to be stuff that I buy that I might think is interesting or not interesting or horrible or good. Either way, look at it. Uh, things they bought on Amazon or online, period, or just in life in general, things that come across my way. Uh, if it helps others out, then I'm going to put it on here if it helped me out. You know, I've seen a lot of videos on YouTube that I've watched that have helped me build a fence or just buy you know the product if it was bad and not buy it save my money whatever have you so that's what i'm hoping to do with this channel if you like it i like subscribe if not leave a comment you know tell me what i can improve on whatever have you but that's all this is going to be i'm not professional by any means um i'm just an average person doing average things all right guys so my first review is going to be the company's ab i forgot what that stands for they just put abtraps.com, abtraps. It's a humane animal trap. Pretty much it's a live catch animal trap. Now I purchased this because I have this rat that's at my house that has, it must have a personal vendetta against me. This guy is smart. Religiously, I've always used, you know, regular mouse traps. They tend to work good. Victor, uh, then you have a cheaper, uh, dollar store brand Victor's a lot better quality track supply sells these I believe uh, everything about it is just better the the spring load on it everything They're, they both work they both do the job but Victor lasts longer so pretty much this uh, AB I bought off Amazon I think it was like 16 17 dollars it seems really good quality um, it's real simple mechanics everything about it so far works good I did have to do small adjustments so the basics is which uh, which I like, it has this door locking lever. So when the trap gets set, this lever drops down as so and will not allow the door to open. I like that because I saw online a guy had caught a rat, it jumped out the cage as if it didn't have a lock like that. So when I saw that, I was, I was happy to see that. What I did notice was you had to do a little bit of fixing it. Now what I mean by that is it it was it wasn't as sensitive as I was liked it to bend, but all I had to really do was pretty much bend this top bar, and there's an inside bar <clears throat> that connects the platform to here. So when I push on the platform, it releases it. Okay, the problem was this from the platform to the ring up top, it it wasn't tight enough. It gave a lot of play, and I didn't like that because I wanted to be hairline, I want that, the rat being this smart, I want it to go off as soon as he puts anything on it. He's just that smart. So far, I like the product. I think it's it might work really well. Hopefully it works better than the regular mouse traps and hopefully outsmarts him. I'm gonna put some leaves at the bottom to mask the, the bottom mesh to maybe not scare him off. Um, I'm gonna put some peanut butter and some dog food, maybe some bird seed, but uh, so far, I like the way the product's built. It feels sturdy. Again, that's AB Humane Animal Trap. I'll put their link in the description with the, it's gonna be the Amazon link pretty much. So you'll either have a video of, of a failed attempt next or one with a rat in it. I'll let y'all know.